Good morning. Hey, it's Tuesday and I'm out on the Willoway dock. I snuck in ahead of the cruise here. Let's take a walk through the dock. Well, first up, we see these a lot on dock videos. Here we're looking at the five gallon Buxus Winter Gem. Fantastic value on that. Look at that plant. Next up, we're looking at our grow bag uh, Skyrocket Junipers. And here uh, we see these were grown in the field in the bags. We brought them out, put them in the pots and get them ready for you to present to the customer. They just need to cut that bag off and they're good to go. Beautiful skyrocket junipers. Again, you can see the nice consistency. A lot of landscapers and wholesalers getting into these uh, five gallon bucks of winter gems. Well, this is the time of the year. Grasses are very popular. Here we're looking at our three gallon hamlins. You can see they're starting to plume up. Filling that can, looking great. Three gallon Tennessee hamlins. Here we're looking at uh, some beautiful echinaceas. We have a lot of selection on those. Still have some nice bud and bloom plants. Again, grasses are very popular on the dock. Here we're looking at uh, a proven winter variety. This one is Cheyenne Sky. Very nice uh, two gallon. These are Carl Forrester grass. A very nice uh, grass here. We're looking at three gallon panicum. This is heavy metal. It's a beautiful sunshine coming in here again. We're looking at uh, Echinacea, I believe that's soft orange in the Artisan series. Hackinaloa aureola grass. Here we're coming into some Coreopsis. These are moonbeams. We also have Sienna and uh, Zagreb looking good. And then gorgeous uh, lavenders. Here we're looking at uh, Delphinium. This is the Degena series here. Very nice bud and bloom plants. Here we have some great looking hydrangeas. You know the guys have cut them back and uh, got them shaped up very nice. This is uh, vanilla uh, strawberry sundae, I'm sorry, in a two gallon from first editions. Again, beautiful two gallon plant. Then here we're looking at our three gallon. This is syringa dark purple. Really good value. Again, grasses. Be sure to check out that full line of grasses. Here we're looking at three gallon gracilimus. Gorgeous color and texture. We've seen this on the dock last week. This is Sambucus lemony lace. And then next to them we have some two gallon My Monets. And then coming over here we're looking at uh, the Proven Winter selection on Spirea. This is Double Play Doozy. Here we have our selection of Viburnum Prunifolium. This one is Summer Magic. Gorgeous native Viburnum. Nice glossy leaf. Great fall color. Then I'm going to spin over here and look at our three gallon Nuss Spruce. Again this one's always on the dock. Good reason. Look at that plant. As I said, you know, we're stocking up here, shipping out grasses. Here we're looking at three gallon zebra grass. Another look at those uh, miscanthus, you know, in threes. And again, a lot of nice uh, three gallon. This one again is zebra grass. Gorgeous grasses on the dock today. Keep us in mind on ground cover. Here we're looking at uh, some ivy and pachysander and flats. And now we're looking at a three gallon burning bush. Good value on that. Great fall color plant. Another peek at those uh, Coreopsis Moonbeam. Again, bud and bloom, very nice full 19 centimeters. And then here's Burginia and a gorgeous foliage plant. We don't get a lot of flower on that, but man, it gets an intense fall color. Looking at some Rubus Heritage. Again, that's a great raspberry uh, ever bearing there. Here we're looking at some uh, Clematis Paniculatus. Nice full trellis. This one will start to show some color very soon. And again, the Echinaceas are all over the dock here, so it's some beautiful bud and bloom plants. We're looking at Hellenium. This one happens to be Ranchera. Loaded with flower buds, great fall color plant. Anemones come into their own this time of the year. We have several varieties here. You can see their bud and bloom. Salvia is looking good. And then Acanthus. Look at the size of that plant. That's lavender sensational. Very nice. Here we're looking at some three gallon bobos. Liriope, again, very nice full plant, some color on those. Coreopsis moonbeam, again, is very popular. Several varieties of Dianthus coming out now, looking good. There is your uh, three gallon Endless Summer. They're doing split trims on those, keeping them nice shaped, uh, starting to bud up. The knockout roses, again, are bud and bloom. They're coming here to give you a cross section. The Paint the Town Dianthus. It's, again, several varieties are looking good right now. Here we're looking at double knockout roses. Again, 
Those split trims are doing wonders. You can see here, beautiful full plants. Look at the buds coming out there. Great shelf life on those. Beautiful knockout roses. Nice uh, landscape size plant. We're looking at our seven gallon. These are Myri lilacs. And then the ever popular, this is the worry free crimson cutie. Big, beautiful plants. Nice color. Again, this one is a sterile barberry. Nice shape on these seven gallon. Uh, this are cranberry creeks. Another order on those uh, skyrocket junipers and the grow bags. Again, beautiful full plants coming through. Boxes Cranberry Creek won't disappoint you as far as the shape. Nice full plants there. And then here we're looking at seven gallon Hetz columnaris. There we're looking at a nice consistent pull on the three gallon Buxus uh, winter gems. Again, good value there. Gorgeous color on Spirea this time of the year. This one happens to be candy corn. And now we're looking at the three gallon Salix Nashikis. Coming off those Nashikis here, we're looking at Ilex. Uh, Little goblin again for tisseladas. You can see here starting to set some fruit, and uh, that gives you a fall interest with fruit and foliage. And again, a second look at those three gallon nest spruce. Beautiful. Here we're looking at our crop of uh, seven gallon hydrangea limelight and tree form, and then uh, I see a little Henry in threes. Great uh, three season interest, short type compact habit, and has the spring flower and amazing fall color. Very nice three gallon Mugo Pines here. We also have Pumelo. And then coming in, do you see the beautiful uh, Potentilla? A very popular lilac for landscaping. This is Syringa Miss Kim in a seven gallon. Gray collar in the 19th centimeter. These are Hosta Patriots. Again, we see these on almost every order. The Barbary Crimson Cutie, nice size to them, good value. And then coming back, we're looking at 7 gallon for Scythia Spring Glory. We always have several varieties of salvia. Here we're looking at uh, Marcus. And, uh, you know, they haven't quite started to bloom, but they're loaded with flower buds. Well, the crew started to come in here to check in, and here we're looking at Budley and Miss Molly. These are gorgeous, tight, full plants loaded with flower buds. Nice order here. We have the uh, Raspberry Shortcake, and this is from the Bushel and Berry series, and uh, you can see here, beautiful full plants. This is a thornless raspberry. Liriope continues to look very nice. We have full plants here in both the variegated and uh, the green types. Looking good. Here we're looking at Calethra, 16 candles, another very popular plant throughout the summer. Gorgeous uh, three gallon azaleas coming on. I just wanted to give you a peek at some mums. We do the hardy garden mums. This is the first crop starting to release, so if you got them, this is a great time to get them. These are shaded, beautiful, head of the game plants. Several varieties of our perennial hibiscus are coming on inventory right now. They're gorgeous can full plants, as you can see here. And this is when you want to get them, right? So they're can full, they're flushing, and they have buds in them. Let me just come in there, you see the buds there. Beautiful time to check out the perennial hibiscus. Here we're looking at some more of our uh, seven gallon plants. These are green mountains and sevens. Again, great crop of our seven gallon hydrangea trees. Coming here to more color in the background there, we're looking at Logella wine and roses, morning light grass, and here we have the hack and aloha. Here we have all gold and aureola. Heuchras are always looking good. Here we have several varieties of heuchra. Some of the ferns are starting to come in right now to give you some great fall color. And of course in the background there, again, grasses have been hot. Just going to span here. We have a lot of container trees coming up. We have uh, more coming on in the near, very near future. The spirea here we're looking at is uh, goldbound in threes. And you can see all those echinaceas. The guys here are getting ready on some more of those beautiful uh, three gallon knockouts. Again, with that split trim, they're loaded with flowers, guys. Here we're looking at a uh, proven winner hydrangea paniculata. This is a newer one. This is quick fire fab. So, this has the early blooming capacity of quick fire and a much shorter habit. Beautiful three gallon quick fire fab. You know, Sestinas are always a very popular landscape plant. Now we're looking at our two gallon. This is Physocarpus tiny wine. 
Well, I'm not going to complain with this beautiful sunshine, but I think you can see all the new growth on these Barberry Rosy Glow. And trees are starting to come up to the dock here. Here we're looking at 15 gallon. This is uh, Green Giant. That's landscape grade. Another order of the, the grasses. Again, this is the Panicum grass from Proven Winners. This is Cheyenne Sky. And here we're looking at uh, 3 gallon Summer Crush. You can see there they've been trimmed back, nicely shaped. They have buds in them. They're going to show some color here. Gorgeous. Three gallon Summer Crush. Again, knockouts won't disappoint. Several varieties. And here we're looking at Lavender Phenomenal. Again, Lavender this time of the year is very popular. More Cheyenne Sky. Three gallon Gracilimus. We have several varieties. The 19 centimeters are great value as well. Coming down here, these are uh, three gallon Morning Lights. And then our three gallon Green Mountains. Here we have Monardas. I believe that's Pocahontas Red. Several varieties of Monarda coming on. Here we have Veronica, Moody Blues, Asters, Purple Crush. Look at that nice color on Aurelia Sun King. Again, the Dianthus are coming on. Gorgeous anemones. Here we have Variegated Iris. You know, this cooler weather, they're starting to color up even more. Good value there. See them pure joy in the background. Lecanthemum, several varieties there. We're looking at uh, Leatris coming on. Be sure to check our availability. Nice, rich, dark color on the Physocarpus. These are summer wine black. Wow, there goes the grasses up to the dock again. Well, that's a quick walk through the dock today. I think we've seen a lot of great looking perennials, flowering shrubs, trees, landscape sized plants. Be sure to get with our sales team. Geez, I hope we're loading a truck for you.